Modern design is supposed to improve our lives, but there are some not-so-genius products out there that are beyond facepalm-worthy and just unnecessarily strange. From totally useless items to unnerving ideas, here's some of the most uncomfortable things ever designed. Family mealtimes can always be jazzed up with some new table decor, but perhaps this puking cat gravy boat isn't the best thing to pull out when you have grandma over for dinner. This off-putting product claims to be perfect for any meal, but honestly, after seeing a cat throw up all over your dinner, would you still want to eat it? Some people enjoy creating wacky solutions to problems that never really existed to begin with. Take this product for example, which has been created to ease the stress of typing with a fresh set of acrylics. Because plastic nails must be protected at all costs, right? You can now attach your own silicone fingertips to this Silence of the Lamb style answer to all your office needs. Avocado lovers out there can now rejoice because there's an even easier way to satisfy your craving for a millennial avocado on toast. The avocado stick is the perfect way to enjoy your favorite snack on the go without the added fuss of opening a fresh avo. I doubt that this highly unnecessary invention would pique everyone's interest with its unnerving roll-on deodorant-like appearance, not to mention the fact that Mother Nature kinda keeps avocados fresh for us already. Cycling to work is a great way to cut down your carbon footprint. But if you feel safer on foot, worry no more. Meet the shoe bike, which combines the thrill of cycling with the familiar feel of pavement underfoot. Kinda. This harebrained invention was created to demonstrate the effectiveness of Adidas's high-performance running shoes, and it actually works surprisingly well. Between those furious vibrations and its ridiculous appearance, though, this is still one seriously uncomfortable design. And if the world isn't already using enough unnecessary plastic, someone went ahead and designed this box of Tic Tacs, which is inexplicably filled with 60 more tiny boxes of Tic Tacs. Each one seems to contain a grand total of about five Tic Tacs. Is this some marketing ploy to encourage healthy portion sizes? And couldn't they have at least organized them better to please my inner perfectionist? People like to pimp their cars with all kinds of interior decor, and bobbleheads can be a real source of amusement. But this dashboard wiggler is definitely more terrifying than fun. This little fella, known as Slicey the Pig, is based on an old French cartoon and is designed to look like he's carving himself up as he wiggles away maniacally. What better way to disturb your passengers into never getting into your car again? Crocs might be considered one of the most hideous footwear creations, but these fake feet sandals could just give them a run for their money. I can't imagine a situation which would require someone to inconspicuously disguise their feet as flip-flops, but at least these exist now should the time come. Speaking of ridiculous products for unusual situations, take a look at these dentures with a hidden USB stick. This disturbing hard drive might not go down so well at a Monday morning board meeting, but it could be the perfect gadget for an OAP super spy. If you're looking to stand out at the beach this summer, what better way to make a statement than some denim swimwear? Yes, this crime against fashion really exists, and they claim to be totally chafe free too, which is good to know. There are plenty of designs to choose from, and whether you're at the beach, fishing, attending a festival, or even out hiking, these babies are guaranteed to keep all eyes on you. Plenty of people have trouble sleeping on long haul flights, and finding a comfortable position with such limited space can be a struggle. But the face cradle is here to change all that for you. With this unique headrest, you can annoy the passenger behind you by strapping yourself to their in-flight entertainment system and then sleep peacefully while suspended face down. If you're prepared to sacrifice your dignity for comfort, I guess this design isn't too bad after all. If you're a wine lover, then you'd be smart to steer clear of this wine glass, unless you want to end up with red wine all over yourself and your brand new sofa. The more you think about it, the more frustrating the idea of drinking from this becomes. This infuriating design is the work of Athens-based artist Katerina Cambrani, who created it as part of her collection of deliberately uncomfortable objects designed especially for your inconvenience. Here's another one of Cambrani's creations, the chain fork, which is enough to make anyone's toes curl. The torture doesn't stop there though, because there's a whole range of useless cutlery in her catalog, which have been designed to ensure that you never get a bite of solid food again. But that's not all. Take a look at this useless tea set. Just imagine pouring that thing. Or even worse, trying to take a sip from the ridiculously elongated mug. Fashion isn't everyone's forte, but you'd expect a world-renowned pop star like J.Lo to have better taste than when she stepped out wearing these hideous jean boots. They may be Versace, but that certainly doesn't make them okay. And this should be solid proof that shoes and jeans should never mix. I guess they are time-saving if you suddenly need to run to the bathroom, though.
People loves to love the royal family. And what better way to support the union of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle than wearing their faces on these flattering swimsuits? Plastering the face of the royal heir and his wife all over your body is definitely one way to grab attention. Not to mention Harry's interesting beard placement. But why stop there? Try Will and Kate on for size, and maybe even the queen herself. If you're an avid cyclist, it's important to remember bike safety rules, and a helmet is the most essential item to have before you set off. There are plenty of options out there, but this big head helmet is equal parts impressive and disturbing. Drivers might mistake you for Megamind or some other freakish humanoid with this thing on your head. If you also happen to be a bald man with a beard, that is. There's a reason clothing is designed for specific body parts, but that doesn't stop some designers from messing with the system anyway. Take a look at these hander pants, which are made from breathable cotton and designed to wear underneath your regular gloves to keep your hands extra toasty. Are you naked under those gloves? Seriously, put on some hander pants, dude. I can just about let the hander pants slide, but these croc gloves are absolutely unforgivable. Not only do they look incredibly uncomfortable, but all those holes are going to provide no warmth whatsoever, making these ugly and pointless. Thankfully, the guy who designed them got a speedy cease and desist from the official Crocs brand. Clothes say a lot about a person's personality, and they can be a great way to make a statement but this sweater is really something to behold. It must be hard to know exactly where to look when someone is literally covered in nipples, making this one incredibly uncomfortable design, although it does look kinda cozy. This bar stool has been designed for maximum comfort for all the guys out there, so why does it somehow still feel so uncomfortable to look at? Maybe it's the implication that for someone's crown jewels to fit perfectly, they'd almost definitely have to be naked to begin with, which is a pretty disturbing thought. Nowadays, wired headphones are being gradually taken over by Bluetooth connectivity, but this unique design has found a way to embrace the wires. Unfortunately, they also make it look like you've got slimy insects crawling into your ears, which isn't a, such a pretty sight. The hairbrush is a pretty standard device, so there's no real need to redesign it, and I'm certain nobody asked for this unnerving alternative to be created. Is there really anything more uncomfortable than imagining the sensation of a hundred tiny rubber fingers running through your hair? Maybe this was created for the same people who need this creepy hand-holding phone case to remember what a human touch feels like. Selfie taking seems to be the standout staple of millennial culture, but I'm pretty sure everyone was doing just fine before these so-called selfie shoes were designed. Yes, they really expect you to insert your phone into the toe compartment before sticking your leg into the air to snap a pic with pals. It's definitely harder than it looks, not to mention how ridiculous those elongated shoes look to begin with. Once again, this hands-free pizza pouch is nothing more than a ridiculous solution to a problem no one had anyway. It's hard to imagine a scenario where you'd have just one slice of pizza which urgently needs saving for later, let alone wanting to stick it in a plastic pouch and carry it around with you. But hey, at least this guy seems pleased with it. Fanny packs are a great way to store things on the go without having to take a big bag out with you, but this dad bag has some seriously questionable design qualities. If you're a slim guy, this unique bag gives you the opportunity to rock the so-called dad bod complete with a hairy belly button. And it comes in more than one design too. I guess this is one way to sneak alcohol into a football game. Sometimes a second opinion is needed when putting together a new outfit. And anyone thinking about purchasing this $990 Fendi touch of fur shawl should probably seek some friendly advice first. In case you're wondering exactly what makes this designer item so uncomfortable to look at, try turning it upside down. Adding a touch of the natural world to modern design can have a big payoff, but if you're going to make cutlery handles from tree branches, you should probably consider removing the thorns first. Sitting down to eat your meal with a knife and fork like these would be like attempting a sadistic saw game but sometimes pleasure does equal pain. Every child loves to play in the park on classic swing sets and roundabouts, but there's something not quite right about this slide. Besides the fact that it looks like a shiny beige tongue, the slide is a total recipe for disaster because it literally has no railings. Seriously, making it to the bottom of this thing in one piece would take some mad skills. Speaking of uncomfortable play park designs, this hardly seems an appropriate design for a children's climbing wall. It doesn't seem all that practical either. Maybe the whole thing just melted in the sun one day? I wonder how many parents have struggled with this design. Hey kids, why don't you go play on the, uh, ooh. This so-called dog dicer is incredibly uncomfortable for any member of the male species to look at, not to mention how pointless it is to begin with. Processed frankfurters have got to be one of the easiest things to cut up, 
and who's consuming enough of them that they need to be diced in such large quantities. Bathroom design can get pretty fancy, but I'm not sure the owner of this sink properly thought through their choice of marble before installing this questionable design. Any unsuspecting guests would probably think they'd walked in on some unspeakable scene of smeared poo before realizing what's actually going on. No matter how many times this bathroom gets cleaned, it's always going to look filthy. Snuggies may not be the coolest products around, but they're certainly cozy for lounging around the house in. But have you ever seen a baby Snuggie, otherwise known as the Peekaroo? The mother and baby in this photo might seem incredibly happy with this invention, but I just can't shake how much this resembles those horrid chest-bursting aliens from the Alien films. Speedy note-taking is a skill most people acquire over time, but with these personalized alphabet notebooks, you can ensure that you never take coherent notes again. The idea might seem sound enough, but how did these actually make it into production without someone pointing out that it would be virtually impossible to get a full sentence out in any of these books? Things don't get much more uncomfortable than this solid steel beanbag. It takes a real evil genius to take something as innocent as the classic beanbag and turn it into a cruel joke like this. Just imagine the pain of jumping onto it without realizing. Thankfully, with a price tag of $4,500, this criminal design isn't likely to appear anywhere but in someone's millionaire mansion. Which of these terrible designs did you find the most uncomfortable? Let me know in the comments below, and thanks for watching.